guys shoot log if your camera supports log shoot it shooting log you'll thank me later whatever you do put your camera well that is if it supports it log just shooting log just do it right now i'll wait for you i'll wait give it a second a few moments later good you found it i know log is not the easiest thing to color to edit to play with but it is so worth it and let me give you a little backstory to back up my theory one day i just had literally one day one hour to head out to a far garden to shoot the japanese irises that were coming to an end the season is finishing right now so they're probably all withering and dead lifeless so i only have one hour to shoot them and i decided to just shoot in log i wanted to play around some more with log when i came home imported the footage and i had to work that's why i had one hour to shoot so after work open up the vinci check out my footage and to my unpleasant and <sighs> panicky surprise everything was purple like blue purple it's like someone took some blue dye and just slapped it on my splashed it on my face and all i could see is just blue imagine putting blue gel film on your glasses and you look through that that's what i saw in da vinci everything was blue fortunately i did shoot everything in log so playing around with the contrast with the temp and the tint i was able to get my white balance fix so that's the great news so the moral of the story is just shoot log and better yet make sure you got your camera settings before you shoot i have forgotten the settings from my last shoot which I was shooting in low light, complete darkness, and I had my white balance, I think it was like a 3,200, something like that. It was like 3,000 Calvins. I don't know what it was. It was just cool enough that it turned everything into blue in the daytime. So guys, just make sure you got your settings straight, but also try log, just do it. If you're shooting in other scene profiles or simulations, uh, you could do another quick take using the log just for testing just take like five ten seconds of your time shoot it in log and then go back to your scene style or your scene profile whatever and uh, go about your business but then later on play around with the log and you'll see there's a huge difference in what we can do in post with log and you don't need an expensive editor you don't need premiere or final cut imovie does a great job with F log, uh, Sony log, any log, it doesn't matter. You still can play with contrast, saturation, and your temps and tints. So, yeah, you don't need an expensive editor to, to play with it. So, give it a test, give it a swirl. And especially if you if you are using DaVinci like I am, you're gonna see how much fun that is when you start playing around with the uh, LUTs. And there's so many LUTs in the YouTube. Just go to YouTube and F log. Uh, videos just search any of vlog videos and most of them will have some sort of lot package for us to download and uh, Yeah, I've been having fun shooting log and in this case it actually saved me so Shoot log guys you thank me later Until then you're welcome. And if you approve of this message smash hit kick click do whatever you want with the like button or the dislike button will work just as well i think or it might be broken so you probably only have one option to just hit the like one so go ahead and just just hit that one yeah it'll, it'll help me out a lot but thank you so guys so much for taking your time and watching the video see you guys on the next one peace